this old town of Foix nested in the Ariège Valley at the gateway of the Pyrenees enjoys a very rustic cuisine. Many of the delightful riverside restaurants serve their own version of cassoulet, the famous gatsi bean and vegetable stew with local sausages, small goods and duck leg. The weekly farmer's market is worth a visit and is very popular with locals, many of whom seem to enjoy an alternative lifestyle. The quality of the valley's vegetables is superb. A small free-range chicken farmer sells eggs and poultry, which his customers tell me are amazing. Two nuns from a nearby abbey sell a beautiful range of cheeses made with slov and the milk from their own farm. Merci. Yum. This is raw milk. I had not tasted raw milk for about 30 years but here they sell it at the market and people buy it, a lot of people buy it and they make yogurt and they make cheese and they use it for their kids and they just drink it. Really delicious. At the butcher shop, the charcuterie and the hanging dried hams are so appetizing that I wish I could take some back home to Australia. La saucisse de foie, the sausage of foie is the great speciality of the region. It comes dry or it comes fresh. Both of them are made with pork liver and pork meat and spices. The dry one is eaten like that, but also it is a great specialty in an omelette. And then the fresh one is just grilled, served with mashed potato or the local milas. It's really nice. Like it. This baked trap dish with herbs and bacon is a traditional classic of the region. I dry a freshly caught trout with kitchen pepper and place it on baking paper in a tray. Then I mix a little lemon thyme with salt, pepper and extra virgin olive oil and I brush the trout outside and inside with this seasoning. Next, I fill the inside with three slices of lemon, two bay leaves and three whole cloves of garlic and bake the trout in a medium oven for about 30 minutes and baste the fish with olive oil a few times. The key is to keep the fish moist and the oven must not be too hot. During the cooking, I finely dice an apple and place it in a bowl with the juice of half a lemon three tablespoons of olive oil, two tablespoons of chopped walnuts, and a little salt and pepper. I then cook two diced rashers of bacon in a pan. Once the fish is cooked, I transfer it onto a large platter and spread the walnut and apple dressing on top. And I scatter the bacon pieces over the top. This treat, roti aux herbes et lardons, is a very special treat. The Madiran wine region is at the crossroad of the Pyrenees and the southwest, and tomorrow I visit Chateau Montus, a winery that makes exquisite wine.